Assalamu alaikum everyone. Welcome to my channel Sunrise English Academy. Today's topic is Honors Post PRA Department of English Air Subject Literary Criticism and Final Submission 2021, Session 2017-18. This is Part B and Part C. Submission is the same. Common for the children. Part B. Why does the Edward say Admir Joseph Conrad? Two, what are the characteristic Victorian criticism? Three, what are the different estimates of enunciated criticism? Four, why does Arnold earn the 18th century and age of prose and tourism? Five, what is the touchstone method? Six, how does Arnold describe 18th century literature? Seven, what is charlatanism? Eight, what is Arnold's view of Joshua as a poet? 9. How did Eliot assess Johnson as a critic of the metaphysical poets? 10. What are the influences of Milton and Dryden on the poets of the later ages? 11. Make a comparison between the metaphysical poets and the modern poets. 12. How, according to Edward said, cultures serve as an instrument of imperialism. 13. Why does Edward call his culture and imperialism and exilist book? 14. Trace after Edward said the relationship between the novel and the Western Empire. 15. What, according to Inleton, was the literary background of 18th century England? 16. What is Inleton's attitude to romanticism? 17. Discuss Inleton's assessment of Arnold's view of the role of literature as a substitute for religion. 18. Why was scrutiny project an absurd movement in context of the rise of English? 19. To what extent is Inleton critical of Eliot's contribution to English poetry? Part C. 1. Discuss Matthew Arnold's views on characteristics of good or poetry nature and function of poetry. 2. Poetry is the criticism of life, governed by the laws of poetic truth and poetic beauty discussed. 3. How does Eliot refute Johnson's remark on the poet whom he classified as metaphysical? 4. How does Eliot distinguish between unification of sensibility and dissociation of sensibility in the metaphysical poets? 5. Why does T.S. Eliot prize Tony's ability to unify the intellectual thoughts and sensation of feeling. See, what nature of Western imperialism is highlighted by Edward said in his introduction to culture and imperialism. 7. How does Edward say show culture as an instrument of imperialism? 8. Discuss after Imleton how the rise of English is connected with the growth and consolidation and of imperialism. 9. Bring out how Inleton links the rise of English to the crisis in modern civilization. 10. Discuss the prose style of Terry Inleton with reference to the rise of English. Please subscribe our channel Sunrise English Academy and press the bell icon also.